my recollection of that match obviously was pretty crazy, but I lost. You won. The crowd sensed the decisive moment. Ivan Izovic does too. One of the, my favorite Wimbledon memories growing up was watching uh, you play all those finals, especially the first one against, uh, against Andre. I know it didn't go the way you wanted, but you created a, uh, a fan uh, for life. It's championship point. Wimbledon final in 2001 meant a lot to you. You came from nowhere leading up to that tournament. You were really bad, actually. It was a big honor to play in 2001 Wimbledon. I was one of the seven that you beat on the way to the title. And after the match, honestly, I thought that if I didn't meet you uh, that day uh, on grass, I would never do that. Uh, it was an honor to get to play you uh, in 2001 uh, at Wimbledon, or at least that's what I thought before the match. Probably what you did to me in the third round is probably the single best serving exhibition I've been on the receiving end of. I, I can assure you it's something that I never wanted to see again. I remember playing you in the fourth round. We had a tight opening set, lost it in tiebreaker, 7-5 in the tiebreaker, and then you went from strength to strength, beating me 6-4, six, 6-4. Four, six, four. One very important match we had in Wimbledon. I thought you would, of course. You know that. But his induction wouldn't have happened unless I let him win that semi-final at Wimbledon in 2001. Fast forward to the Manic Monday in the final against, uh, against Rafter. Final was a drama, it was a great match and very exciting. I, I know we were all on, on the edge of our seats and I think sentimentally with everything that you went through, I think we were a, a large part of the tennis community was, uh, was cheering for you and was really happy uh, that you finally got your, your moment at, uh, at Wimbledon. Clearly, I remember you winning at 9-7 in the fifth set on the Monday. That's very rare to have a Wimbledon finals on the Monday. And I remember you praying, trying to get the same tennis ball when you served it out and finally won the championships. It was an amazing match in the terms that it created so much incredible atmosphere. But I have to settle for second place. <laughs> Just this. Welcome to the Hall of Fame, you crazy, crazy, crazy man. Congratulations. Best wishes for the future. I just wanted to send a message to Goran Ivanisevic, uh, congratulating him. Very well deserved, uh, not only, of course, as your tennis career, but also as a human being. You really deserve it. You had an unbelievable career, getting to a career high number two. Goran, congrats. Well, you were one of my idols. Well, big man, what can I say? Congratulations on your induction into the International Hall of Fame. You deserve it. <laughs>